Hi, we want to create this short video to illustrate how easy it is to schedule multiple showings at the same time. Let's set the scene. For this video, I'm the buyer agent and I have a client who wants to see properties this Saturday. I've run a search and here will identify the properties my buyer is interested in. Once I have them selected, the showing time button at the bottom in the button bar is enabled and ready. The first thing we'll do is confirm our contact information here is correct, and then we'll go ahead and do one of two things. We can add to showing time to create a new cart, or if there's a cart already created, we'll simply add it to a pre-existing cart. When creating a new cart, you're prompted to select the date which you are scheduling these properties. There are additional options such as adding the buyer. Adding your buyer provides additional sorting and reporting by client capabilities. The description allows you to identify each showing appointment on the calendar. Both make it more efficient and save you time. When finished, click OK to create your tour. After you create your multiple listing tour, you'll see a map displayed that shows where the properties that you pull into showing time are located. This gives me the ability to change the showing order either manually or by using the Smart Route. Smart Route is a really great feature that allows the system to geographically sort the listings in the order that makes the most sense and saves you time. If there's limited availability in the schedule for each of those properties, you may have to manually do that instead. Once the listings have been sorted in the right order, you're ready to do things such as add additional start and stop points. For example, if you're picking up the buyer, you'll want to add their address, both as a starting and a stopping point. Perhaps you're planning on hitting a restaurant or a coffee shop on the way home to discuss a possible offer. Once you have all of your listings in the right order, you've added all your additional stops that you want to make that day, you'll be able to select the showing times on the right. You may start your day at 10 o'clock, so you'll select 10 a.m. for the first listing. Between each listing, you'll see a time and a distance marker, helping you plan how much time you need between one appointment till the next. Continue the same process for all the properties and stops you have listed. Now, when ready, you'll click the Send Requests button. Once the scheduled requests have officially been sent, you'll see different indicators here based on the property's showing type. Appointments that are automatically confirmed will appear with a green circle and a check mark. Initial submitted requests, as well as ND rescheduling requests, will appear with a red triangle. Any other stops or listings that are displayed with a drop down are not managed by showing time. If it is a stop, you can mark it as confirmed. If it is a listing that needs to be scheduled outside of showing time, you can utilize the different statuses. However, keep in mind that the drop down use is optional. Once your tour listings are all confirmed, you can print or save either an agent or buyer version of the tour that can include driving directions and other custom options. Be sure to check out support.veritamls.com for more showing tips and tricks.